crafters, welcome into Guys Craft 2. My name is John, and I just wanted to share with you, I told you last week we went to the um, Scottsdale show here in Arizona, uh, that it really wasn't a quilt show, but it was more like, um, I don't want to say a swap meet, but it was a, just a place uh, that a lot of crafters, quilters, different things, uh, it was very quilt focused. We were lucky we had a lot of companies in from different states. Uh, I'm told not as big as it had been in the past because I guess there were some national shows going on. But that said, I had just ordered uh, this package from a company in Idaho called Block Party uh, Quilting. Absolutely loved their website. Had to have this um, particular item. And they actually showed up to the um, event. So I got to meet the husband of Block Party forget his name. I'm not even sure if he told me his name, but um, this package actually just arrived for us. Really excited uh, to get this. I am hoping, among everything else you know that we've got hanging on the wall, that I'll end up knocking this project out, but uh, we'll see. I ended up getting this. It's called the Christmas Gnome Quilted Table Runner, and I got everything to do it for $38.95 plus shipping, I think. Yeah, and they only charged me $2.99 shipping. So, I mean, it had to cost them that probably to ship it from Idaho to Arizona. But with that said, I wanted to show you this. It is just too adorable. Um, and so I am really excited that it is here. <coughs> Hope to get started on it. Uh, very soon. I've got a couple other projects I really kind of need to get out of the way in order to do that. Plus, I want to use the big long arm today and actually stitch out my first quilt on it. But that said, I got what's called the Forest Dwellers. It's a quilted table runner pattern. It is 16 inches wide by 60 inches long. So it is a nice big full table runner. I am going to show you what the pattern looks like. The pattern is just adorable. I like the Christmas trees and I like the um, gnomes for every other tree. Now, I will say the only thing that I typically would do different on my table runners is I would flip uh, typically. So if you're sitting on one side of the table, you have a couple of um, whatever looking at you. And if you're on the other side of the table, you have something looking at uh, looking back at you. For this type of pattern, that's just not really po probably possible. Uh, it would totally change the scape and look of it. I'm not sure, to be honest, if I'll even use this as a table runner. I will probably use this as um, more of a, a wall hanging, more of a banner. because We've got a couple of places that that would absolutely work. They do send you the templates and everything that you need to make it. I bought the kit versus the pattern, so everything came pre-cut. Um, all the fabrics, everything for me. So I really wanted that because I didn't want to take the time right now to do that when I'm just struggling even to get some of the projects done. And I really like the colors they picked. I will tell you, I believe when I looked at this, it comes in two uh, background colors. This is gray, uh, and it also comes in white. I did not like the white. Uh, if I'm thinking of the right one, it just didn't pop to me like this gray does. And if you notice, when you watch a lot of stuff that we do, especially as I start sharing more and more uh, Christmas stuff with you, you'll see that we don't, for some reason, do a lot of white uh, gray backgrounds. So for this to be a gray background uh, is kind of different for us. But again, it's from Block Party Quilt Company. I think they are a husband and wife team. Uh, I'm not even sure if they have a retail space or how they are building their uh, business out there and how long they've been around. But I really, like I said, just stumbled on their site the other day, actually through a YouTube video, fell in love with the instruction and that she was giving around uh, this particular item. I ended up buying a turkey time table runner from them. And it actually has the turkeys going in two different directions. I bought that from them, and I bought something else from them that I don't... Oh, I bought a mountain quilt uh, kit from them, and it's all in those beautiful rust colors and oranges and uh, blues and teals and that. Uh, it, again, also came as a full set. 
I would never want to try to pick the colors that they had already picked for that um, mountain quilt. The colors are just beautiful. Uh, so I'm anxious to get all of these projects started, especially when I get this one done uh, in time for Christmas. I'm not sure I'll get the turkey one done this year for Thanksgiving, but we'll see. But um, if you've not seen their videos in that, I will drop a link on my website over to them. Uh, like I said, he, uh, the husband, was a super nice guy. We talked uh, about several things. They have some really cool patterns, and I think they're doing some really neat things. So if you haven't stopped over there, definitely stop over. So I appreciate you dropping in listening to me ramble for a few minutes. Uh, again, excited. I hope maybe uh, we might even try to do a live when we put this together. We'll see. Uh, we're anxious to start doing that. But thanks for dropping in to Guyscraft 2. My name is John. If you like what we're doing, hit that thumbs up for us. Uh, we are one subscriber away from 200 subscribers. Uh, we're just amazed. We had no idea three months ago that we'd be at 200 subscribers. We have not really reached out to like friends, family, and things like that. Our subscribers are people like you that are finding us on YouTube and think that we're doing some of the right things. And that just really means a lot. Uh, leave comments uh, in that. We love to hear your comments and um, also love to, for you to jump on our Facebook page and tell us what you're doing. We love the share uh, that happens in this YouTube community. But until next time, happy crafting.